hey guys you're welcome back to my channel this is ifix by billionaire hobby and um, in today's topic we'll be talking about something that so many of us have had um so many theories so many stories and so many misconceptions about and um it is nothing other than the catalytic converter of your vehicle now so what is wrong with you this boy are they paying you now we need to find out what this part of the car actually does and the reason why it is a major target for car vandals okay so there's so many misconceptions that uh, one of the major news is that fly around there is that this part of the vehicle is what helps in reducing the car's um, consumption or fuel consumption of the vehicle and um, I'm here to debunk that news or that story that you heard about um, the catalytic converter being the part of the car that helps reduce your car um, combustion. <laughs> oh, I'm not too much. Or your car fuel consumption okay so um if you're new to the channel please i would urge you to hit the subscribe button turn on the notification bell and um, of course share this video to someone you feel needs to get this information and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much you guys are the real mvp thank you so much for always watching our videos and sharing and liking and also i'd like to hear your thoughts in the comment section so let's get right to it now what is the catalytic converter okay a catalytic converter is designed to help reduce harmful emissions from the car now just like the name implies catalytic and converter it's self-explanatory it actually means catalyst and conversion now the catalyst a catalyst simply means something that aids or that helps a reaction process that helps a reaction take place now conversion means moving from a to b transferring or converting from a to b okay so pardon my word for word definition 70 years old man anyway something that just moving from one point a to point b that's converting from a to b okay so when you put them together now a catalytic converter is the thing that helps convert the harmful emissions from your engine to a more environmental friendly emission you get it okay. if you don't get it forget about it so the byproduct of a complete combustion is um co2 and water of course but because combustion in your engine due to several reasons due to several components the heat factors the the chemicals the oils and uh, everything that burns up in in the engine due to all that factor combustion is not complete now and this combustion process is designed in such a way that it it goes out through your exhaust pipe okay now let's get this right due to the fact that this combustion is not complete and there are some harmful gases that are emitted that come out from your car which are very very harmful to 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 us human beings to the environments we have the major one which is the co that's the carbon monoxide which is very very toxic and exposure to this can actually make take um, cause the loss of lives and also depletion of the ozone layer mm -hmm. so this catalytic converter the major the sole role of this catalytic converter is to reduce or to convert this harmful emissions into a more environmental friendly emission okay and this is done in two processes which are one the reduction process and the oxidization process now let's talk about what's inside the catalytic converter of your car so when you cut the catalytic converter of the car open there are two major things you're going to see first is a ceramic now this ceramic just gets hot the main tool duty of this ceramic is nothing else but just getting hot and um, it's the heat that is being generated in this ceramic that also aids in this conversion process now the second thing you're going to see inside this ceramic are precious metals now these precious metals are palladium uh, platinum and rhodium now these are the major things or the major target for these car vandals 
because um, <clears throat> each of these precious metals go for as high as $40 per gram. Now, this is actually what this caravan dials go for. So next time when you're stealing, then you know where you won't go thief, okay? Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. You understand which they go thief. And uh, because I hear a lot of people talk about, oh, okay, they steal your um, catalytic converter and they would sell it to you in the black market to go and install in your vehicle because it's going to help your car reduce fuel consumption. Now, that's a big fat lie. It doesn't work that way. Now, on the other side, I mentioned earlier on how this catalytic converter works. It works with um, two processes that are involved, the oxidization and the reduction. Now, the reduction reaction has to do with um, unbinding um, oxygen from the nitrous oxide that's being emitted from your car and um, allowing it's allowing the nitrogen now being shot out at uh, through the exhaust pipe now for the um oxidization reaction now this has to do with binding oxygen that was removed from that nitrous oxide to the carbon monoxide that was emitted from the e engine so this now gives you carbon dioxide which uh, is an environmental friendly gas okay for um, plant respiration and all that so this is how the catalytic converter works and for people that say that catalytic converter actually reduces car consumption car fuel consumption please where did you get that information from i, I got the advice from a madman mm. because um okay i'm going to paint this picture for you and you'll be the judge if you want to talk to me talk to me direct don't go through the corners okay so when your car catalytic converter is taken out the whole emissions just go through your exhaust pipe and they just get flushed out like that without any um any stress any work done now but when you have your catalytic converter these emissions are being arrested in the catalytic converter and Trust me, a lot of work is done and I mean, a lot of work is put on the car and before these emissions are pushed out through the exhaust pipe. So which one do you think would make the car run on higher fuel? Is it when the catalytic converter is there or when it's not there? You can be the judge. You think they are wise? You are a mumu man. So guys, on that note, I think um, I'll be calling it a day on this topic. And um, if this video was educative, please do well to hit the like button, um, turn on the notification bell, subscribe to our channel, and also share this video to people that you know or you think should get this information. All right. Thanks for watching. And also, you can also hit us up on other social media platform. Look up our, our shooting gears, the things we use, the, my personal stuff. You can hit on the link in the description box and um thanks for watching guys